Hey everyone, my name is Mike DeMauro and I want to do this special video and podcast because I feel that there needs to be change in this world and there, it needs to be done now. As you may know, back on May 6th, 2023, there was a shooting that happened in Allen, Texas at a outlet mall that killed about six to eight people. And it was so heartbreaking that one, even one of the victims was three years old that died. It, it tears my heart apart to see all these people die in a senseless act of violence. And it doesn't need, it doesn't deserve to happen in this world. I don't know who or what is causing all these problems in this world, but it needs to stop. We need to have peace and we need to have action take place. We need to have representation in our state, local, and federal levels. You need to let your state officials know. You need to let your local officials know. And you need to let your federal officials know that we need to have gun control in this country and take the guns away from people who cannot and do not have the capability of knowing how to use them correctly. You know, it's so sad to see all these shootings happen. You know, I remember back in 2012 when Sandy Hook happened. And that really brought me to tears because it was it was like 80 miles away from my hometown. And then in 2016, when the Pulse shooting happened, just like a mile or two away from where I was living at the time in Orlando, it, it changed my life. And, you know, these things need to stop. And another shooting that affected my life is the Parkland one that occurred on February 14th, 2018. You know, all these shootings need to stop. These people need to get help. You know, and guns is not the solution. We need to stand up. We need to take action. And we need to find help for people that need the help. Just because you might be suffering from depression or something else doesn't mean you should go and attack a business or attack a school or attack a church or whatever else. I am calling on all of you to take action and take action now. Talk to your local officials. Let them know that this is not okay in your cities. Talk to your state officials. Let them know that this is not okay in your state. Talk to your federal officials. Let them know that this is not allowed on the federal level as well. We need to bring justice and we need to bring awareness for everyone that guns are not the solution. Please, 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 please go out there in the community and do something. Spread awareness. Doesn't matter how old you are. Doesn't matter what your disability is. Doesn't matter what race you are. Doesn't matter what gender you are. And doesn't matter if you're rich or poor. Everyone needs to follow the rules. And everyone needs to go and protect our lives. And make this a peaceful world. We need to have a peaceful world, and we need to do it now, because you never know when the next attack is going to happen, and the next shooting is going to happen, and by the time the next shootings happen, it might be too late for people already, so 
we need to prevent more shootings from happening in this in this country, in the state, in the world, in the cities. It doesn't matter where you are. We need help. And we need tougher gun laws in this country of the United States of America and throughout the world to not allow people to go and shoot other people, whether they're playing around or not, because these are serious things that occur in our country, and we cannot take it anymore. I am praying for everyone in Allen, Texas, as they mourn the losses of the people that were shot on Saturday, and the other communities too, since 1999 and beyond, or and back, of all of those shootings that have happened in the past. Nobody should be a victim. Nobody should be shot and killed. Nobody doesn't matter who you are. Nobody deserves to be killed by a senseless person. And if you are feeling like you have mental health problems, please go seek a counselor. Go seek a, a friend, a family member, a parent. Maybe your sister or your brother. Maybe your grandparents. Maybe your aunts and uncles. Do something and do something now. Don't wait until it's too late because you never know what's going to happen in this world. And we all need to protect everyone and we all need to protect ourselves too. So please, I'm praying. And Heavenly Father, in the name of Jesus, I pray that all the people who have gone through the shootings in Allen, Texas, and other shootings around the world, to please know that we are here for them. We will help you. We need to help them. There are resources in this country. There are resources in this state. There are resources around the globe that can help you. Please guide these people for help. Because no one should suffer a loss of a family member. No one should suffer a loss of a friend. No one should suffer a loss of a co-worker. No one should suffer a loss of a child. Or a parent. Or a grandparent. Or anyone else. No one needs to go through what they Please, I'm begging everyone, please, please help everyone that you can to make sure that we can have a peaceful world out there, that we can all live together in peace and help the people that need the help. Give them mental health tools, you know, and please send a prayer to all the people who have lost someone in shootings, please send help to them too, because they need the help from all of us. And I thank everyone. Thank you, Jesus, for all of you have done to help the people so far, please. And help them get laws passed in the cities, the states, the countries, everybody around the world, please guide everyone to talk to their elected officials and to get laws passed to ban guns from everyone without the proper training of them. Thank you and amen. I hope you guys truly know how I feel about this. And violence is never the answer. So please, please, I, I want you guys to know that we're going to be there for you. Seek help if you need it. 
and please, please don't go shooting people. And please, go seek help if you need help. And also, please go and talk to your elected officials, no matter what level they are. Whether it's city, state, county, our country, worldwide, we can't have this happen anymore. So, thank you so much for listening on my podcast and if you're watching. And I pray that everyone gets the help that they need and that we can make this a peaceful world for everyone. Amen.